Welcome back, guys. We have four days to go until the financial report, and we need to go out on a new mission. Uh, unfortunately, we are a little weaker than we were before, and the missions do not look as easy as they were before. I don't think I want to defend a base, and I certainly don't want to do any of those big ones. Well, maybe we can do a blackout. Maybe we can do a blackout. It's a four and a half skull. Against Nueva Castile. You know what? We'll take all the loot. And we are only three. So I think we'll bring out the Seth. Uh, and the cloud buster and even the fireworm that takes us up oh it's maximum 400 tons then we're not doing that because we'll be so under underweight well it's gonna have to be a defend base then Yeah. Okay, three shields, four skulls. Do we want to roll with that? Let's bring the Seth as well. That's not Batangas. That's normally Freebie, who is currently in the Mad Dog Prime. Isn't it normally Freebie? So he is No. Is it Bengal? I don't think we have anyone with affinities for it really. No, no, no. Don't save that. So Let's bring Batangas. Get the best of the best out there maybe. Yeah. Oh, she can't pilot it. I don't have anyone here who can pilot it. Who can pilot it? Freebie. Or Bengal. Or Archer. Or Lagatha. No one else. Well, who has the least affinities? Freebie, you have 14. Bengal. You are up to 31 on the Sun Bear. All right. Bengal it is. And then I think we'll bring Cold Fire out of this guy and put him in here and we'll start training up braver maybe uh, yeah maybe braver So, Seth is going to be Bengal. Why did we go down? Cloudbuster. It doesn't take us up to them. No, it's the... F oh, we, we can't do the fireworm because... We don't really have anyone to pilot it. So, Scotty, I guess, in the Cloudbuster. So three and a half shields, four skulls, badlands, defend base. Let's see if we can do it. I'll see you guys when we register up. All right, guys, we're on station. Let's try and defend this base.
Command interface initiated. I think it's going to be a little rough. Okay. Destroy the enemy vanguard over there. Cover the friendly lance there. Okay. I think we'll land somewhere like here. Confirm. All right. Some Mackie and the Lindworm. All right. Cold fire. Well, cold fire is a bit of a problem because he doesn't have much ammo. Right, Commander. All right, let's see if we can see what they've got. Four small rack lasers, frame, flame breath, rocket 15. On an awesome. A sky raider. With, whoa. With a bunch of energy, ballistics, and missiles. Mackie with... A ton of rockets. Okay, you need to go. And a Lindworm with three large chem lasers. Okay, so the Mackie is the biggest threat. Feel like. So let's try and set up for taking that out. Guardian ECM to active. Now, we don't want to move too much away from the base because I'm guessing that the next batch will come from over here or something. Sen. Brace. Right. We have a friendly longbow. That's interesting. And a friendly Corsair. Okay. Minuteman. Alright. Done. Steamer Duck. Freebie. I actually just want to move you up here and brace. Bengal. I think I might use the daisy cutters to take down the Mackie. Where's their target area? I don't see a target area then. Oh, there it is. Scotty. What to do with you? I think we move you over this way to deal with the awesome. Or at least to start to deal with it. Uh, Guardian Museum to active. I forgot that on Lagatha. At least the Mackie is slow. Is that really the only way I can get? 
direct line of sight on that thing? It seems like it is. All right. We're certainly not going to use Swarm or Thunder. Okay. Um, freebie. Fire. Archer. If you come over here, you can start help Lagatha with the awesome. Well, we tagged it. Lindworm now. Not too worried about that. The Sky Raider is a little worrying. Because we can't see what it has on it. Wish. Longbow open in the back. Longbow running away. Here comes the Sky Raider. Don't know what that thing has. And I don't like it. It's never not nice not knowing what the enemy has for weapons. Which there goes the right torso on the logbow. Okay. Um Braver. No, not Braver. Can you hit that thing? Not really. Can Minuteman? Not really either. Where is the Mackie hit? Okay, and Mackie isn't until turn four. When is Bengal? Fifteen. Gonna try and hit this bloody thing. I think we're gonna go incendiary. The hit chance isn't that different. Uh, steamer duck. Well, if we can take this thing out with steamer duck, then we don't need to use our daisy cutters and we can save them for some other da dangerous target. Oh, well, we didn't take it out, but it lost a lot of its rockets. Just move and brace, buddy. Scotty. Still has a lot of rockets, though. He isn't hot at all, so... Yeah, get to the target zone, Corsair. Sin. Can you please finish with that Mackie off? Not quite, and he's not even on his back. How might I help? It's 
So we're going to have to put him on his back with this guy or take him out. But we can take him out, I think, or put him on his back without using our daisy cutters. There he goes. And a big bada boom. Glad we didn't have anyone up close and personal. Alright, Lagatha. You can hit him. Yeah, pretty good hit. Ooh, the Lindworm one. And the Sky Raider one. Okay. A little surprised about that. Then we're running away. Kinda. So it's a Sky Rider. Sky Raider. Well, if we can hit this guy, that is also in the back. All right. Yeah, get in there. Beautiful. Turrets are online. Fire. Actually, cold fire. Come back here and hit that Sky Raider in the back again. Okay, Bengal. You can come back here and hit the Sky Raider in the back as well. Man, that thing is not willing to go down. Hmm. What if you move in here? That just makes it worse almost. Yeah, it does. Right, it will not take a lot to kill it. There it goes. Okay. Archer. Ooh, you can actually get in the back of this guy. That could be a kill. That could very well be a kill. Not quite. Steamer duck. I wonder what you can do against this thing. How much armor do you have? Some. It's not the most dangerous target, but it's an opportunity. But I want to take. 
that it has its back to me. All right, it's the awesome's turn. Ooh, he is running away too. All right, well, sent. We're gonna shoot at the Lindworm. Dang it, Scotty. Uh, just move. Come over here. And I guess use your flak. Will we have enough? Yes, we did. Lovely, lovely. And then Lagatha. You can, in fact... Get a back strike from there. I knew you were going to have to tur turn something off. Well, he's open. Favor, just stay around here. All right. There he goes, from a turret. Okay, we're gonna start pulling back towards the base. Just because we don't know where they're coming from next. Probably from two directions, right? I feel like they normally do. Uh, let's turn your jet booster off while this is going on. Alright. So we have to survive another eight rounds. Looks like enemy reinforcements. Come on. So there's something over there. And then there's something over here. A Highlander. With a lot of laser MS and large Rex lasers. So that is not a missile target, which kind of means the longbow isn't a missile target either. We have a battle master with some ear PPCs, lasers, and a buster hauler with a light rifle, a medium rifle, and medium laser agra. Then we have the Efreet with a daisy cutter bomb. A gremlin, a roughneck, and a madcap that we don't know what has either. Alright. Well. Well, since he's already moved, he's obviously our best target. Because he's easier to hit, not because it's better to shoot at a target that has already moved. Uh, I think I need you to move over this way to deal with these guys. Because you don't have any missiles. I really should wait until they've done their thing, shouldn't I? I always forget that. 
because then we can actually hit them. Pasta Hall is shooting at something and missing. some kind of missiles uh, freebie hmm I kind of want to take that e freak out because it has the daisy cutter Well, we've got some damage on it. That daisy cutter is, I think it's 125 damage. All by itself. And that is scary. Archer, you're going to move over in this direction as well. of that Highlander. We have long tom artillery coming in from the Gremlin. What's the plan? So I mean we can hit the Gremlin. One hundred and six damage it is. I mean, if we use both of them, we might be able to do it. It's a terrible hit chance, though. Let's just fire this. Start putting some damage on it. Because I don't like that long time stuff. Scotty. I think you shoot at that thing. All right. Cold fire. Fire. It's also just nice to, nice to take it out because it's stealthed. I think he's shooting his friend in the back quite a bit. Sin. Come on, Sin, you can do it. Wow, that is a terrible hit chance, Sin. It hit, though. Hey, Lagatha. You're going to come over this way as well. I think we're going to turn your cockpit hot seat on this time. Just to get you a little closer. 
That's all we can shoot at. Is it even worth shooting at it? Not really. And Braver. Who can get out of the long tom artillery's range just in case. Oh, and I keep forgetting to check the the ECMs because I'm pretty sure I forgot to do some of them. All right, Steamer Duck. So when are you? You're 21. We have Freebie. Who's there? Who can maybe do something? Minuteman, who's over on the other side, but could potentially turn around before it's its turn. We have Scotty, and we have Bengal before it's his turn as well. All right, Steamer Duck. Just move over here and shoot that gremlin. Alright, gremlin down. Minute man, you're not going to turn around. You can't really shoot at anything over here though. So you're going to reserve. Freebie. Wow, 80.7 there. Alright. Scotty. Please finish this thing. Nope, it's not down. I do. And this is the wrong side that I went to. Again. Alright. It's down. No daisy cutters for us. That's good. Minute man, you're still reserving. Coal fire. I mean, the Timber Wolf is the more dangerous target, I think. But the Roughneck is so delightfully hittable. Now it's unsteady. It's turn 18. Minute Man is going to reserve again. Right, it's Lagathan out. I don't really want to go in the water. Just come over here. These are horrendous hit chances. Well, we got a little bit of damage on both of them. It's the Roughneck's turn now. So I'm not unsteady anymore. 
pretty good hit on freebie there. Sen. Let's try and hit that roughneck. Very nice. The streaks didn't fire though. Corsair. Oh. Putting some damage on them. Those are medium heavy lasers, aren't they? Or large heavy lasers. That could also be. Well, since the longbow is over on this side, let's bring you in this way. Archer. I mean, you can't really get close to any of them. It's too long distance for you. But it's the same on the other side. Guess we just try and tag something. That's a lot of our firepower. Basically useless. What was that that exploded? He exploded himself. I can appreciate that. Well, there goes one of our turrets. That's a shame. Minuteman, you have a target now. Fantastic. I think we're going to go for the Highlander. Uh, let's not go incendiary, though. Roughneck is open. Pretty decent. Okay. Well, I, I suppose we try and take this guy out. Well, we still have pretty good hit chances with the high explosives. Steamer duck. I don't think we need that much for him now. So I'm gonna go for the Mad Cat. Scotty. Maybe Scotty can finish off the Roughneck. Yeah, it could be. We certainly destroyed the torso. Sin. You can then probably finish it off. No. But he's on its back and I think that'll either kill him or punch him out. Kill him. Okay. Hold fire. All right, Mad Cat open. Yeah, critical hit. 
archer. I mean, you're gonna have to go in the water. You don't really have a choice. Sixty-four, thirty-eight, fifty. Okay, sixty-four, thirty-eight. It is then. Fire. We got the tag mark mark on him. Bengal, what do you have left here, buddy? Uh, I think we can come over here and just drop one daisy cutter, maybe. Yeah. Well, that's him dead. All right, then we can focus all our fire on the other side, which is fantastic. Now, I want to take this guy out. Because I want all those laser AMSs gone. Well, I'm pretty sure we've got this, and, and that is nice to know. Oh, I thought I was shooting at the other guy. Never mind. They both need to die anyway. AMS range there. Yeah, those are some big lasers hitting us there. So it's not a bad thing taking that Highlander out quick. Sun Spider taking some damage. Alright, some uh, Battlemaster didn't want to shoot. That's appreciated. Ooh, nice, I hit it. Alright, Minute Man. Uh, minute Man, why don't you use your field command? Because I keep forgetting to do that. I think I want, I'm going to do it, and then I forget to do it. All right, he's open. Oh, you can actually see something from right there, Sin. Eighty-eight point seven percent hit chance. Nice. Right arm destroyed. Steamer duck. Uh, you're gonna wait. So is Freebie. Uh, he won't be able to shoot at anything anyway. So you just come back this way. Uh, Bengal. Let's turn your booster on. Move over this way so you can help out with the last daisy cutter and your other stuff. Scotty. Uh, let's just bring you in this way. So 
so that you can shoot next round. Cold fire. You're going to wait. Archer. It's the right side that has been hit the most. Go vigilant. Shoot the crap, up, crap out of him. Very good. I don't want steam and duck right now. Who do we have left? Over here, Minute Man shot already. Lagatha is left, but she's not until turn 12. And that's about it. So I guess Steamer Duck it is. I want to take him out. And we did. Good job. Cold fire. Wow, the Buster Hollow is hard to hit. The longbow is actually the easiest to hit. All right. Hit on the longbow. Just three enemies left. Braver. Just come up here and go vigilant. What are you shooting at, Longbow? Archer. But Archer is now in AMS cover. Battlemaster is pretty hot. Lagata. Uh, if you can get in the water, that will help the heat. And we can actually fire everything. All right. Battlemaster open. Nice. He ejected. Lovely. Freebs. Yeah, you, yeah, you might have the range with the standards. Yes, you do. But you can't face it. Dang it. Steamer duck. Direct line of sight from there. Obstructed, but direct. And no more longbow. So just the roughneck left. It's not the greatest hit chances. Tag missed. Just punch out, dude. Uh, you know what? You have sensor lock, so let's try and sensor lock him. 
Minus two evasion. Lovely, lovely. Oh uh, no. Just... Why can't you sprint? Well, you can shoot the old Ray C fives. And you actually got a hit and destroyed a riot light rifle, so that's nice. And you made him almost steady. That was well done. Send you can get line of sight over here. Fire. Nice. He's out. He is out. Fantastic. Mission successful. Nice. Nice, nice, nice. All right. Let's see see what we can get. Some clan LRM ammo would be nice. 595,000. We didn't take much damage here. We have 419, so we could get, potentially get an awesome. Can't get the Battlemaster. We can get a Highlander, which is a 90 ton Omnimech. It's a quick sell, though. So I'm not super duper interested in that. No. We can get a Lindworm, but I'm not interested in that. The Sky Raider. Four medium can lasers, two, medium, two weapons base, two missile, Phoenix missiles times three and one AMS flare. Nah. All right, disassemble all. Hmm. The gremlin parts are worth quite a bit, 435,000. That's good to take note of. E-freak parts are okay as well. Let's see what else is here. There's an AMS Mark II. We have one. HM6 Pirate Daisy Cutter Bomb. Yeah, I thought it was 125 damage normally. Bomb Inferno Mines. Yeah, medium Laser PPC. Yeah, PPC. Laser AMS Quick Cell. RM20. RM5. There's absolutely no clan stuff here. There is an AR-12 sheath beacon, though. There's an XL Indian. I think from what I see that's around here, we might just be going for money for the rest of it. Mm, I do like the Slick Sweet Cockpit. Slick, slick Network grants plus 3% sight and sensors, plus 1 initiative and plus 1 tactics for every Slick Sweet unit on the field. So if you can get that on everyone, more or less, that's a lot of sight and sensors and initiative and tactics. Mm, there's some Typhon LRM ammo, which is nice. Mm, yeah, I think I think we go for the money. So that means 
awesome part. Awesome part. And then. No, wait, awesome. 49,000, not 498. No, 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 no. No awesome parts, please. We want gremlin part. Gremlin part. And then I think it's the, yeah. It's the Excel engine. 325. Heat sink double, 325. Industrial TSM is only 208. Could also take that slick sweet and maybe start stockpiling them a little bit. Let's do that. Confirm. So we did get an awesome part anyway, but we will just sell it. Battlemaster. Battlemaster, Gremlin, Gremlin, Linworm, uh, Longbow, Mackie, Roughneck, Ooh, and four Sky Raider parts for 270,000. That's quite nice. Large Pulse Laser can go. LRM 20 can go. Rock 15 can go. She's Pippin Stays. FCS Multi Track can go. Remote Sensor to dispenser well we'll keep it we don't have any long term artillery no we already have seven bins of that ammo so we'll do like that not a big haul but quite good money i'll see you guys back on the argo all right guys we're back on board let's see the damage it shouldn't be too bad it shouldn't be too bad 152,000 in seven days. That is very, very acceptable. And we're up to 9.6 million. It's actually that guy, so. Yeah. Well, we can now go on to the financial report. Accept. And let's get the Jägermik back as well. Uh, uh, tell him to give it to Batangas. She has low spirits. Uh, the Jägermik is fine. It was just very, very damaged. So we have the Jägermik back. That's great. So uh, we are ready for the next mission in the next episode. So thank you very much for watching, guys. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, why not leave a like and subscribe, and I'll see you next time.